Hi, it's Adrian, and I'm back with a new haircut and a new palette, and so I thought we'd go ahead and get started. And um, I was just, um, basically my ends had gotten to the point where I needed to go ahead and get um, give them a chop, and then I had done a um, trim in my bangs. It was me, and I went a little bit high, so I wanted to go ahead and thank Supercuts for helping me out and evening everything out because my trim was a little bit wonky, and they went ahead and redid it, and so thank you, Supercuts. I really appreciate it. And to go ahead and get started with what I have on today, oh, I have a lightning storm going on over here so if you hear that I just don't have any other time to go ahead and record so uh, what I started with today was a L'Oreal True Match in C1 I added a little bit of the Milani Conceal and Perfect 110 these are the bronzing drops in 110 and I added in a little bit of the L'Oreal Lumi Lotion and this one is, I think it's their lightest shade, yeah. So these are the combination that I have on as far as the foundation today. And then what I did go ahead and use as my concealer today is the e.l.f. And this one is in the light rosy. So that's what I have on as far as my concealer. As far as what I went ahead and did for uh, the actual cheeks today, I got out my Hourglass Ambient in Universe, and so this is what I have on there. And I did go ahead and use the bronzer, the blush, and the highlighter, and a little bit of the uh, face powder here. So um, I have everything except for the bright pink on. And I did go ahead and add in a little bit of the Moira. And this is uh, one of their highlighters. This one is in Dreamlight. Yeah, Dreamlight. And so I added a little bit of this on as well. And a little bit of the Rare Beauty, the Mesmerize. Because if you have a little bit of highlighter, a little bit more is even better. <laughs> so that's what I did there. Um, I did use some of the glowish powder and the, let's see, this one is Fair Light, so it's a little bit darker, and so that's what I have on, as well as uh, the Universe palette. So I have these two on today. As far as the lips, I have the Maybelline Superstay Ink Crayon in number 145 on. And then I added a little bit of the Adept uh, Gift with Purchase in this, their lip gloss in Beator. And again, hope I'm saying that right. I'm not sure exactly how to pronounce that one. And then as far as my new palette today, I went ahead and picked up the Daylight palette. Hello. Okay, that's really loud. Um, again, that's the thunder if you're hearing that. And the Daylight palette. <laughs> Uh, this one's by Alter Ego. You can get Alter Ego on their website. Uh, this is what the palette looks like. Um, I went ahead and used this one in the crease, and then this one right above the crease. Used this on the outside of the lid. And let's see, I used a little bit of this on the inside of... I actually took it from here to here, and then here to here. Um, I did go ahead and put a little bit of this one uh, right on the brow. And I think that's all I did other than using this as my uh, eyeliner. There we go. So um, I'm not usually a neutrals person, let alone a neutral brown sort of. I don't collect palettes like these. I did go ahead and see the palette... Um, the I Need a Nude from Natasha Denona, which this one's supposed to be inspired by. And I didn't I didn't really like it the first couple of times I saw it. Then I swatched it and went outside and I went, Oh, that's really pretty. Um but again, this isn't the kind of palette that I'm just gonna grab for all the time. But I'm actually kinda glad to be able to get it and go ahead and um see what I think as far as neutrals go and yeah. 
Um, like I said, this is a first impression. I just got it. And as far as the way that the eye look turned out, I did go ahead and use the Call Me Queen as far as the mascara today. And I think that's just about everything that I went ahead and used. Um, let's see. Uh, like I said, it's a first impression. I did go ahead and do some swatches. So here are the swatches. And it is a very neutral palette. Um, like I said, it's a first impression. I haven't really played with it yet. Uh, do kind of like the sparkly effect that I'm getting from it. And um, yeah, I think that's the video. And I'll see you later. And um, have a great day. And hopefully you won't be in the monsoon that I'm in right now. <laughs> but I'll see you later. Bye.